Modern Pest Services is the company people have turned to for years all over Maine and New England whenever they've got a problem with insects. But what do you do if the problem is bigger than a bug? Fortunately, Modern Pest has got you covered there too with their wildlife control team. Joining us right now, Colton Tumac. He's general manager of the wildlife division for Modern Pest Control. It's a pleasure to meet you, Colton. Pleasure to meet you. So, uh, here's the story. Animal in the house, panic ensues. What do I do? The best thing is to call a professional. Um, there's so many different things that can happen or have been happening that you don't even know about. But you're best off looking for someone to deal with that problem, to diagnose exactly what's going on. What are the common nuisance animals that modern pests can handle? The general species that we're taking care of are bats, squirrels, both red and gray, flying squirrels, and birds. Uh, we also do trapping services for groundhogs and raccoons. When I start hearing noises, or maybe even seeing an animal, it's time to act. Absolutely, you know, just because you just heard it doesn't mean that it hasn't been going on. Uh, you know, it is potential that it's the first time it, that animal is there, but there's no reason why it couldn't have been, you know, going on for months and you just never heard it. Response time is key here, and that's where a company the size of modern pests comes in handy. We actually cover all of Maine, New Hampshire, and Massachusetts. We have wildlife service professionals in all three states uh, in quite a, a range. Colton, when I recognize there's a problem, uh, the reaction oftentimes is to call the police or maybe the animal control officer. But nine times out of ten, that's not going to do me any good. They're going to ask you to call uh, an animal damage control agent. Uh, something that all of our wildlife service professionals are, we're all licensed to do this type of work, and we're the ones that can come out and diagnose and offer you a solution to your problem. With regard to that diagnosis, how do you go about that? Basically interview the client. We're asking them what time they're hearing it, what they're hearing. Those things are really important to us to start deciphering what type of animal might be there. We'll do a walk around the exterior, a lot of times we can tell just from experience what, what we're looking for there, whether it's uh, an obvious chew hole, whether it's type of construction that allows animals entry, or to actually go up into an attic, look for uh, places in the attic where the insulation's been torn up, uh, chew marks, damage to wires, those sorts of things. Droppings are obviously key for us to determine exactly what what species is there. You've gathered sufficient information, you've been able to diagnose the problem, now what? Now we actually have to offer a solution to alleviate the, the issue at hand. Um, whether that's trapping or exclusion, we have to make sure that we can get the animals out of the house, get it sealed off so they can't get back in, and be able to let the client know your house is animal free. Certainly these are nuisance animals, but people have concerns about what happens to them after they've been removed from the home. Yes, a lot of our clients want to know what is going to happen, what's the fate of that animal once we do trap it. We use uh, have a heart traps, so everything's caught in a live trap, and we do translocate those animals whenever possible. Some states are different, but whenever possible, we're taking those away, the animals aren't harmed, they're let go in the wild. Excellent. So people can rest easy that they don't have a problem anymore and that animal's got a chance. Right. We're not, we're not destroying the animal once we leave your property. We are taking it to different locations and, and letting them go. Colton, now that the animal has been removed, the immediate concern is dealt with, but what about the damage that's been left behind? Right. The, the aftermath of that problem is what did they do in the attic? Did they damage the insulation? Did they chew wires? And that's something that we take care of as well. We'll go in and clean out the soiled insulation, clean down the surfaces and sanitize and deodorize, and then we actually offer the service to blow insulation back in using a tap insulation. It's an insulation with outstanding values that we can apply and control the R value that we put back into the attic. The problem has been dealt with, the animal is gone, but they got in here once. What's going to keep them from coming back? All of our exclusion work comes with a one-year guarantee, and that is something that you can actually extend beyond. It is what separates us from you know, another company or another person doing the same type of work. Colton, what we've learned is that Modern Pest Services is providing peace of mind. We provide a professional wildlife service and solution for homeowners and businesses 
that will help them minimize property damage and health risk.